What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. Obviously, it is it's a live cop video and it's happening 4 o'clock, so about an hour away, but we had an update and literally I had a no phone notification just came on. And it's actually live now at the Stone Island website, so I wanna quickly go through that. Um, just some of the pricing and see, you know, the sizes and stuff like that. So you can see all the kind of cover jackets and things are all there, leather jacket, denim, um or based on euro it's like 688 euro there uh 448 for the cardigan or jumper and then for the hoodie it's 328 so it's not much a difference between jumper and the cardigan but interestingly the hoodie has a double xl which is very interesting so judging from um, the sizing here we can see that it is potentially going to be available also in Supreme uh, at these double uh, XL sizes as well and then we have a few more the long sleeve at 178 euro uh, we also have the the two pattern based t-shirt which is 158 year old it's really really cool and expensive at the same time but Again, I'm not arguing because it's a Stone Island collab. We also have um, the jeans, the short trousers, or not short trousers, the, the trackies. You also have the a couple of cam cabs and a reflective cam as well. So all of these, obviously, uh, if you can see on the pictures as well, I need to move it around. And these are obviously the kind of like the local images that we have here. I honestly don't feel the back of it it just doesn't really resonate with me but like obviously the front one's actually pretty cool looking and um, i also want to kind of quickly point to attention that i think these pictures are really really nice from um a lookbook or like an aesthetic aesthetic point of view they're really really cool uh, i mean you can see the kind of pricing and drop is here uh, which is great but i also kind of want to go back to the list now we have the uh, retail price here uh, so the <clears throat> the the set of three the bolts here is around fifty four, completely understandable. We have the leather shoulder back at a hundred pounds. Uh, also coming up with the waterproof peel case at twenty eight quid, which I think it is pretty reasonable. I think for the price that they're doing. Um, yeah, I do think like these prices are kind of reflective, reflecting on how you know the kind of collab branding here. Um, I'm also kind of intrigued to see what sell what sells out first, but I also are hoping the waterproof pill case would be something that can, yeah, can be something that I want. I obviously may be highly likely to be going for the black one. I think uh, twenty eight, but we have to see uh, at four o'clock. But we'll come back to that. Um, I'll see you guys in about forty minutes. Several days later. Bringing you obviously quick video now of week 10. Um, I've got, I want to do like a quick run through before um, something different, obviously. I did a screen recording, let me actually play that. So uh, as you can see here, it was, I went on like straight online at four o'clock. Uh, a couple of things that happened. Uh, the jacket was still sort of like, all of them pretty much available to be fair. Um, the only thing that really caught my attention on the day was actually the the backs like backpacks were actually fine but what what amazed me was the actual duffel actually went quite quickly um as well as the cardigan the hoodie basically the full collection is pretty much out like 80 percent as you can see there uh which i'm not you know really surprised because it is one of those bigger week and people are actually spending the money this time and yeah 100% uh, even the pill case here is actually sold out at 28 pounds which I do think it is quite interestingly how it actually went from really really big to something you know not as much but um, lucky if you actually did picked up something from here uh, today it's actually something quite um, hard to get now uh, especially if you missed the Stone Island drop this is obviously the only option that you have um, I honestly was really amazed by the fact that how many items actually sold out on the first day and not even the first day within the first day uh, the first hour of the drop uh, just interested to see how that went so fast um, the only other thing about the leather bags I think 
Uh, I mean, it is debatable. People are, you know, give or take. There are a few more options for people to get from. And the black obviously would outperform the red for 100%, sure. But for a leather, I don't know if it's genuine leather, obviously, probably not for 98 pounds, but I do think it's a little bit of overpriced. And I do think that is something we should be really careful of. And when it comes to like the color choices, like, you know, red is obviously um, not as good as black. And if you did have like other colors that are more kind of signature for that season, we'll go for that. And then black and red at uh, the very last. And then, Backpacks were £258, which was super hugely overpriced. Um, I do think the leather of it actually justifies, but I mean, the layout of it, it's really much similar to the one that I had previously uh, from, I think it was 2019 or something. It obviously was um, fabrics, it was non leather, but it was basically half the price. This is literally um, £100 more, even uh, to say that. but. Uh, interested to see it though. Uh, I mean, the parcel from last week I had received the uh, the poker cards or like the cynical or whatever you want to call it. I'm gonna do an unboxing when I'm back uh, tomorrow, so hopefully we'll have that uh, ready and we can show you guys obviously how it looks. Um, apparently, it's really really small from what I saw on the Instagram pictures and stuff like that. They're really really tiny, um, but I'm interested to open that for you guys and have a look. So yeah, call it a really quick recap to be fair. Um, and it's a, it's a good call out as well. I think it's uh, how people are kind of really interested into the, the leather side of things, uh, which is really sort of surprising with the price there. Anyway, I'm gonna call it a, uh, a week, obviously. Uh, it's Friday now, but hopefully you guys manage to get what you want. If you do have anything to comment or anything and you know, let me know how you think about how 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 it went literally this week with Stone Island because um, it is an interesting one to see how quick it went. So I want to see hear your experience as well. Whether you're copying online, offline, uh, leave us a comment, and I shall see you guys next week.